Hi, I'm Jimmy. With me today is Mike, an installer. We're here to do a comparison about changing codes. We're going to look at the Aero Revolution versus a leading mechanical push button lock. All right, so now we're watching Mike and we're actually timing him on how long it takes to change the code on this mechanical lock. Now there are nine detailed steps involved in changing this code. They're here, I know you can't see them, I'm not going to read them all to you. I will, however, paraphrase what he's doing here. First, he's got to insert the key in the back of the lock. Then he has to unscrew the lock, pull it out, depress the lever handle, then he has to enter the factory set code. After he does that, he has to insert the special tool that he's got to have to get this done, otherwise it won't work. Then he turns it clockwise until he hears it click. Then he depresses the lever and enters the new combination, at which point he depresses the lever again to make sure that the latch is moving. And now he's done, finally, unless, of course, he's made a mistake along the way, in which case he has to go all the way back to step one, insert the key. Now, Mike is going to change the code on the Arrow Revolution lock. Now, the first thing you may notice is that it's voice prompted, which means that this lock actually talks you through the process of changing the code, meaning you don't have to bother with all the written instructions. Now, here's another neat thing. This lock can talk you through the changing of the codes in three separate languages, English, French, or Spanish. This is a very sleek design. It's electronic versus mechanical, and that means a lot less moving parts. It's certified grade one, and finally, there are 255 user codes. That means you can add or delete users at will. Okay, so now we've seen with Mike's help how easy it is to change the codes on the Arrow Revolution lock. There are 255 user codes. That allows you to change out any one user whenever you wish. That enhances your security. Thanks for watching.